Welcome to 55 and Alive. Today I have my daughter Savannah with me and she lives out there in San Diego County and she come to color with me today. So let me show you all my colors. Actually my color pencils. I have a 160 set. I have a 130 set. I have a 130 set. I have color pencils. I think I have about a thousand of them maybe more and this is not it this is not all um color pencil to me is like makeup palette to everyone else <laughs> <laughs> except i can't use these as makeup palettes but there's four palettes in here i'm gonna call them palettes because you know they remind me you know i just i just love these colors these are my, my wood colors look at here oh holy People snort cocaine and it's all gone, but look, I can still color. <laughs> it's left behind. <laughs> but anyway, Savannah, what do you think about me coloring? I, mean, I think it's pretty cool. Like, she kind of said a little inside joke about me because I, I like makeup and my addiction is like makeup palettes. Her addiction is color pencil palettes, as you can see. <laughs> um, so I kind of tease her and she teases me a little bit. <laughs> um, but yeah, so it's going to color and let me just have a mommy-daughter time. Uh, let me show them one of my, my coloring books there. My Coco Twin, just one. Uh, oh, yeah, I have lots of coloring books. This is just some of them. Some of them here, some of them there. Um, these are some color pages that I colored. This is my Coco Twin book. I really like it. And, I mean, you can color whatever you want in this book. I just love it. I just love the images. They look just like me. And I love my multicolor um, color pencils. Um, let me tell you a little bit about my color pencils here. Uh, I brought all my color pencils. Of course, I have another addiction. Amazon. It's kind of a little warm in here. Anyway, Amazon is my second second edition, uh, edition. But anyway, so I have lots of color pencils. I just got these today. Neon, jumbo neon. I have jumbo multicolor, and I have jumbo people colors. And I like all my color pencils. I have so many of them. I don't even know how many there there is there. Then I have the Crayola push-up ones. And I got these on the ship when I went on the Princess. I thought they had coloring pencils in the um, you know, in the in the store, but they didn't. So I went to the kids section, and guess what? I found color pencils. I had some with me, but I want some more. So anyway. Um, I love my coloring books, as you saw the the Coco Twin, and let's make this happy hour. Let me show you one of the colored pictures that I colored. I use my multicolored color pencils. That's a multicolored drink, an orange multicolored orange, a cupcake. And some chocolate. Uh, you know those little chocolate cakey things, you know what you call them. Anyway, I'm gonna get ready and color. What are you gonna color, Savannah? I'm coloring a, a rainbow. A rainbow? I mean a Rapunzel. Rapunzel? Which one are you gonna color? Mm -hmm. Oh, here. I think I have your. I'm almost done with all these pages. You are. I'm doing the color, color my fro. This is the one I'm gonna do, like the Rapunzel. Is it recording? Mm -hmm. Let's see. I don't know which one I'm going to do. That one's full, isn't it? Yeah, nearly. Mm -hmm. I could do brown sugar. Yeah. Brown sugar. 
I have some really neat colors that I just purchased. We already talked about that. I think I'm going to do her all in neon. So when you color, do you have like a vision of like how you're going to color or you kind of just go with the flow? Uh, I just kind of go with the flow. Um, I used to be afraid of all these colors. And... Um, and I started buying uh, coloring books with uh, color by numbers. And until I got comfortable with coloring different uh, pictures and being comfortable with colors. Um, just like here, you see this, Savannah? I color her lips blue. I just kind of start wherever. And then I have some people colors. Uh, here, uh, mahogany. It's a, just a brown here, and I have a gingerbread. That's the same one. Chestnut. I love buying these things as I buy them the same uh, two sets of each colors mostly. So cinnamon. Let's see, ebony. It's a darker brown. Not too dark, but anyway, I might just do her in an ebony color. And there's a couple of other colors. There's fawn, there's toast. You know, we're all not the same color. So I'm doing her braid like a rainbow kind of. Ah, you know, I have a multicolor uh, coloring pencil. Yeah. Oh, but you're gonna do your own. Yeah. Remember when you were going to the Montessori school? You always color, you, know, you guys always use a lot of different colors. The color pencils. I thought that was so neat. How did you even get into like color? Coloring? Yeah. Well, um, you started randomly or? Well, I started off with the Secret Garden book, and I wasn't happy for a while, and and as I was going through counseling, um, my counselor suggested that I would color a little bit more. So I brought some coloring books, and I started coloring, and, and spending a lot of my time coloring, and that wasn't too healthy for me either, because I just spent a lot of time coloring. But, uh, you know, believe it or not, you know, I was colorblind once once upon a time, so I told you that. Yeah, I was colorblind. Not, you know, medically or anything like that. I was colorblind because I was unhappy. I saw everything in black and white. Now I love colors. And basically, I really got into coloring. Just, I enjoy it now. Good. And most of my coloring... You know, it really has a story. I, 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 there's a story behind my coloring. Let me show you a color, a color page that I colored. I like affirmation coloring books. Um, there's a coloring page in here that I did, and it reminds me of when I open your heart. You see, it's uh, gray, and there's colors around it because I used to see in grays and black and white and this picture remind me of the colors that I start seeing around what I was not seeing before and I had to open my, actually I had to open my heart so normally when I color you're gonna see a lot of um, smile more you know a lot of multicolors look at this one Savannah oh, yeah. I use my multicolor. I remember when you used to like send me pictures in the mail when I was in college. Yeah, I did. You used to always send me them. I still have them to my desk, my computer. Yeah. The ones that aren't here at home. Okay, yeah. And there's a few still here. Yeah. Just to write you a little letter. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, you don't always have to send your child a letter. You can send them something neat and And them something that they might enjoy. And I thought you would love, love enjoying those 
coloring pages and plus it kind of encouraged you it gave you a little encouragement that was my thing I wanted to encourage you while you were in college and I needed it yeah do you remember what one of them said nope you don't <laughs> I think I remember a few of them uh, one was uh, keep keep moving yeah things like that um, Life is only good if you, whatever you make it. That's what I'm doing so far, guys. It's, I'm doing like her. Hey. Her rainbow. I like that. Rainbow. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your long hair. I love coloring. I was on this other, uh, YouTuber channel. I went to go visit them in the desert. That's what I'm going to go do, guys, in, in maybe a couple of weeks. I'm going to go to Hawaii first, and then I'm going to go to the desert and color a little bit and to clear my lungs out because just recently I've been having some challenges with my lungs and um, I need to go where there's not a lot of industries and stuff at. So, normally the desert is about the best place to go. But this hard in the trees. It's kind of hot. I can find some cool spots. Can you pass me your, um, your nationality, ethnic colors, por favor? Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Different ones. Here, I, I colored her ebony. Ebony and ivory. This is called brown sugar. You can use the large color and pencil sharpener on this side. But yeah, I think yeah. I broke this, mommy. No, you didn't. Yeah, the, the little side. No, it's yeah. already broke. Oh. Yeah. That's not a very good uh tone. And you were gonna tell me? I was. Oh, okay. So I told you now. Oh. <laughs> okay, no, that was already uh broken. Oh, because I got got the little thing on I thought like, better break this? Hope not, I didn't break it. No. And I can only, only use it for because my big uh Okay. So I'm supposed to color yeah. pistols. Yeah, I'm not gonna feel so bad. Mm. No, it was and it's very expensive. It was uh, a fist car one. Well it still is a fist car one. Yeah. I guess I would do her lettering in neon. I guess this is some kind of purple. Or... I do ebony. Is it ebony? It doesn't work unless you um. You know, sharpen them. They have to have a sharp point. Here's an ebony. Oh, you got an ebony? Yeah. I got two of everything. <laughs> I got an ebony. I like, um, you know what color I do like too? It's called, um, olive. Oh, yeah, olive is a pretty color. I got yeah. a green. Yeah. Green undertone. Yeah, olive skin. Yeah. This is a really good, pretty color. Yeah, it's not tricky because I had did her her hair brown on top, mm -hmm. and so but I was like, well, let me see what color I can do for her body. So I just went with a darker body, so it's not a, a matchy match for yeah. her. her uh... How do you like coloring? It's it's peaceful. Yeah, it is peaceful. That's why I do it. It's very peaceful. I don't think I answered your question, huh? I forgot what I asked you. No, uh, how did I get into coloring? Ahead. You told me. Okay. Your counselor and you kind of just started slowly. You I mean, you've done it for a while, but I don't think you, it was as heavy as it, as it is now. You know what I mean? Well, now it's basically a hobby. Yeah. I really like it. I enjoy coloring a little bit more. And it's just relaxing, you know, definitely because I, I do have high blood pressure and stuff. I try to do things that's more relaxing now. My blood pressure has been really down a lot. So, which I'm happy. Mm. Yeah, I'm really, I 
just love coloring. One of my favorite, favorite pastime. It's definitely so relaxing, so just seeing the colors now and enjoying the colors. coloring books lately too. A lot. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I even brought them twice so. A whole lot. Yeah. She's addicted. She's addicted. She's addicted. Actually this is my little um. This is my. This is my enjoyment. I don't do very many things. I don't go to the movies and stuff anymore. Like I used to. But kind of like I said before, like, as she's involved in color, I'm involved in collecting makeup. Yeah, that blue is fierce. Mm -hmm. Look at her hair, it's going to be a uh, blue. Alrighty then. Extra, extra fierce. Mm -hmm. One thing about coloring, you can color anything however you want, you can use any colors you want. That's what I enjoy mostly, mostly about coloring. I make it my own. Someone else drew the picture, but I make it my own. I love these neon color pencils that I bought. That's just really nice. Okay, so this is my progress so far. So I colored her, her little afro and then her little Rapunzel tail. And Cute. then her purple outfit, her ebony skin. I see. You did like pretty good for the first time coloring with me. A brick kind of red. Like a brick red. Well, actually, if you want to look through these colors here. Well, since she has like the the brick, mm -hmm. I'm doing like a brick kind of, okay. kind of a reddish brick. Well, like a reddish brick color. Oh well, yeah, there's <coughs> there's all kind of colors here. Uh, there's like a, a brown, like there's palettes and palettes and palettes of colors. You probably have to, you know, use a, a, a sheet. Mm. And those are brown reds and stuff like that. Yeah, like this brownish reddish. I can use some of those colors as people color too because they have so many different browns in there. <coughs> oh, bless me. I haven't used this set yet. Here's some different reds here. Oh, yeah. I'm not ready to use those. Maybe pretty soon. Maybe, baby. And you know what? And when I do, then I end up in one little container. Uh -huh. And I can see them just like these. So. I like the large. Um, yeah, it's a nice little grip. Yeah, and plus, you know, you can cover more area. neon colors coming in. Oh, thank you for coming over and recording today. Yeah. With me, I really enjoy you coming over and you know, kind of like spur the moment. It's like, let's, <laughs> let's record. Yeah. Really nice. Mommy daughter time. Yeah. As grown ups. You yes. never get too old to hang out with your mommy. No, nope, you never get too old to hang out with your mommy. And your mommy never gets too old to hang out with her daughter. Well anyway, y'all. Um thanks for watching us color today and uh 
We'll show you the end part when uh, we're done with it. All right. See you later.